Morning guys. So when I give presentations, I use Golang's present tool to do it. And I just thought I'd quickly describe my workflow. Here is the finished product. I've actually customized it and I'll show you how I do that. And I usually just upload to talks.webconverter.com my stuff. So how do I do it? Okay. Um, just clone out Golang tools um, and then let's go into present. So present here has the templates. Unfortunately, it's not all built into the one thing. So, so um, anyway, this is how you do it. Uh, let me copy some a slide over, and uh, let me go present that. It's something like oh, yeah. You need this dash base for it to take in the static and templates there, so you can customize it. Okay, so now we have something like this. La, da, da. <clears throat> so for example um, the default style sheet you can't see this right so let's change that let's go here eh, eh, eh. start oh, what is the CSS thing probably here styles look for h2 uh, I would probably put in something from my clipboard something like like that one switch back refresh and see the the border is a bit better maybe add some padding right and padding one okay you you, you get the flow um, and then once i'm I finished um okay let's go back here so obviously you um, you edit the material inside this dot slide uh, file. It's a bit limited, but you know limited limited is good sometimes. Uh, I usually just start from an existing one and just you know edit it to whatever it needs to be. You know YouTube presentation. It looks great on mobile. You know I don't like PPTs to be honest. Um, okay, so, but how, how I archive it is I just go control S temp and then, you know, make the temp archive. Come to me. And Chrome does an okay job of, of basically making that web page static. And, and then I just upload that to talkstopwebconverger.com. So that's how I do my presentations. If you know a better way of doing presentations that sucks less than this, please let me know. Thank you for watching, guys.